save. Alright. Now the boat friend. Boat friend! Riding the boat. Yes. We are going to... Waterfall. We'll talk to the... The turtle friend. Oh, that was different. We haven't seen that one before. X shift to skip dialogue. Oh, can you? I didn't know that. Come again sometime. I knew you could do it. Fluffy buns, why? Okay, okay. I remember it clearly now. It was the monthly address at the castle, and the queen was giving her part in current events. After finishing her update, she moved to pass the microphone to the king. However, she didn't realize the microphone was still in her hands when she said, Your turn, Fluffy Buns. The audience burst into laughter. Realizing what she had said, she started laughing too. After a few moments, the king held up his arms. The crowd grew silent. He leaned towards the microphone. Expression. Stun. Dear citizens, thank you for coming here today. I, King Fluffy Buns, and the rest is history. Is Asgore a goat? Eh? Goat? Actually, that reminds me. The whale once wore a flower pattern, Mumu. Folks kept saying nice Mumu to her, but she kept thinking they were calling her a cow. <laughs> so she never wore it again. What was the question again? Oh, right, Asgore. He's a really interesting type of monster. The strongest type of all. We call them boss monsters. When they have an offspring, the soul power of the parents flows into the child, causing the child to grow as the parents age. But Asgore doesn't have a child, so he's been stuck at the same age, and probably will be forever. Ah, huh? but the child is a human. Ah, that wouldn't work. So if Asgore is your father, he'll definitely outlive you. Asgore and Toriel. Oh yeah, of course, Toriel was queen and Asgore was the king. It was the tragic when she lived since everyone knew she was really the brains behind the throne. But it was also just a teensy, teensy bit relieving, you know? Those two were really inseparable together. Dazzling noses being all cute and cuddly in public. Embarrassing, their children. They were so sweet, made me sick. Thank God those days are over. What about Anandine? Anandine. Undine. Undine. She's really come a long way since she was a little urchin. I used to be a hero myself back in the old days. Garrison the Hammer of Justice. When she was younger, Undyne would follow me around to watch me beat up bad guys. Sometimes she'd even try to help. Though, so, most of the time, the folks she attacked weren't bad guys. Maybe the mailman or something like that. Anywho, I appreciated it. Ah. Bye, friend. Uh... I think it's left, but I'm going to go this way real quick. I think it is left. Save point. <gasps> Let's go talk to Bluke. Blukey boy. This is snails. Where's Bluke? Whoa. Hey. Manitons here. What's Metaton doing here? There you are! Oops. They are apostolic! Feast your eyes, thought they were completed by wonderful new body! I can't get his voice right anymore. That's unfortunate. Oh, and did you hear the barriers open? I can't wait to see the sun! And the greatest spotlight of all! Oh, yes! I suppose I should thank you too, darling. I'm not finding you. I've almost found it. I have forgotten how fun it was to help others. I've been searching for Hot Air, talents, and feel my upcoming trope. So far, Charmin's agreed to be my way to rack up singer. And Naps to Blue Care. 
Look at my sound mixer. The three of us performing together. It really feels overdue, doesn't it? Oof, that was rough. Uh, I just had, I'm a huge fan. Uh, hi, human. I'll never forget when you cheered me on. But as pretending to sleep, I would have never had so much faith in my fake sleep. Uh, also, this is awkward, but... What's your name? Everyone seems to know it now except me. Seems like I've been missing out lately. I was just sitting at home listening to tunes. There was a flash of light outside my window. I saw the snails in the farm disappear. Then I heard the knock at the door. A flash of light wanted to come in. I closed the blinds. Now everyone knows your name except for me. Risk. Okay, I won't forget it. Is this open yet? Nope. Metaton is Bluki's cousin? Is that for serious? Is that lore? Snails. All the other ghosts are gone. Was there anything over here? I don't remember. Oh, yeah, right. Undyne's house. Duck! Yes! Yay! Thanks, duck friend. I probably could have walked around faster, but you know what? You're doing your best. Metaton is a ghost inside of a robot? Is that... That's lore? Really? I never... How did people figure that out? Never picked up on that. I don't remember you. We can only see the real stars now, but I still don't know what those are. I need to go find Tem Village. I don't remember quite how to get there. I think it was to the right, actually. I think it's... Maybe I should have took the duck. Might have been faster. Oh yeah, this creepy thing. Look how happy. You gonna talk to me? No? Just stare at me? Did you hear your book? I saw you a big secret I'm starting to buy out here. It's called the Red Hot Chibi Peppers. All I've thought is the name. And I don't play instruments or sing. Well, do you think we'll be popular? Yeah. Yeah, me too. That thing's creepy adorable. That is creepy creepy. What? I do not remember running to either of you. Hello. It's good to be... It's just... It's good to be with my sister again. Okay, that's cool. I don't remember that at all. Are those the amalgamates or whatever? Hey, a piano. Sure. Eh. Eh. I don't remember what that was for. Oh, this is where the dog stole that thing. Stinking dog. Umbrella. Umbrellas. I'm just kind of running around. No idea where I'm going. I was worried all the raindrops spawned at the top. <laughs> so they fall fell down with me walking and they just kind of look like they were floating in air for a minute. Oh, hey. I remember this part. This part was cool.
Whoa, hey. You came out the way to see me flex? That really says something about you. Thanks, friend. Oh, no, I need Scraggy to help me up there. Dang it. All right. Yeah, you, you try it on your computer? It's something weird with their app, huh? It's so weird. Oh my god, there's so much running. I like that you see your, your reflection, that's cool. <sighs> All the yawns. Kind of starting to stare off into space with all the running. I should have just took the dog. Oh, God! I was wondering what you were gonna go for you since if we did it, uh, I don't know you ever know. Oh, I think my tentacles out for you, you hear? This is what I know, I'll be the first to tell you. You hear? Okay. Goodbye, friend. I can't go this way, can I? Nope. <laughs> Yawn! I really like the music in this game. Well, that's not helpful. Doom, 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 doom. Well, maybe on the way back, we'll go talk to the Tim. Because, uh, <laughs> yeah, if I tell them they're free to go, they might get all excited. Really? The mouse never gets the treat? Seems like the mouse has freed some of the cheese from the crystal somehow. Hey, he's doing it. Whoa. Three gold for the fairy. Hop on. What? Thanks for stepping on my face. Here's the three gold. Hey, thanks. Oh, he gives you three gold. Whoa! Look through the telescope. Check wall. Um... I do not remember... that... Teleport. Who's this? The surface into The surface intimidates me. The entire outer layer of the Earth is made of dirt. I don't remember... Did I just miss this whole spot? The guy step on my face thing. <laughs> All right. No king shame. Ooh. Flowers. And I like that he paid me. Rocks. All right. Hello. This is an echo flower. Oh, yeah. I kind of wish that I didn't keep going left. Wait, we're almost at Snowden. Never mind. I really like the way those trees look. It's locked from the inside. 
that his house is still on fire. Or his room. The door is locked. It's a painting of a cartoon bone. Whoa! Oh, that's right. We've been in his room. He's got that super cool race car bed. Totes jelly. Whoa, look at them all! Have some of my family members. Great. They're always moving. I can see them 100% of the time. All of our parents have been combined into one horrible being. That's okay, though. It's really brought all our families together. This is that cool, crazy guy. He's still... That's all he does. Freaking love it. Ah. Hmm, now that our parents are the same entity, does that mean I'm married to my sister? Wait, we're dogs. That stuff's normal. The library. These guys didn't change. Oh, you're free. Finally. I'll be able to stop smiling. Looks like I don't have to worry about cracking jokes anymore. I was going to say a joke here, but I really don't have one. I heard Dr. Elf is still the king and the queen. The awful things he's done. The king felt so bad that he didn't know. He gave her a big hug. And the queen fired her. Now we don't have a royal scientist anymore. That's politics. This guy's wasted. Or when you, the overworld has hot guys and neat drinks. Oh, I'm ready. Scraggy. Yo, what's up? I've been kind of doing something. Maybe I'm dying isn't actually as cool as we thought. He's just kind of mean. But yo, I just found out about someone way cooler. Yeah. It'd be nasty if your humans are present under the tree tradition. I'd probably be weirded out by it. Mm, furries? That kid over there told me that it's weird that I have a pet bunny. I thought the same thing. First, there'd be nothing weird about it. It's cute. Second, what? It's normal to walk your younger brother on a leash, right? Is anyone else worried about the giant ship thing how amalgamates are, uh... The sight of such friendly town fills you with determination. Hello, traveler. What happened? Human ruins future. Well, I suppose I moved my store to the overworld. I haven't planned much more than that, I'm afraid. Bye now. See ya. Good luck on opening your shop. You think Sans plays guitar? Yeah, I can see him do that. Oh, yeah, I got you. I got you, Crimson. Yeah, on one screen, it's hard to multitask sometimes. Amy, so when I'm the surface, I tell you to me, there's so many people, someone has to, right? It must be bigger on the inside. Oh, I'm sliding. Oh yeah, the goat. That looks, that's, that's exactly the face that was, um, flowy in his creepy form. Everyone's leaving, eh? Good riddance. Maybe I'll finally get some peace and quiet. Nightmare beast. What the? I fell? That was weird. Boop. Oh, hi. Hello, free? Okay, okay, I'll just stop lodging around. Does that dog know? It probably doesn't, does it? Whoa, I got stuck. That was weird. I think that dog will never get trying to make the perfect snow dog. <laughs> Kills you with determination. Perfect snow dog. Alright, these are all... Papyrus's... Quote-unquote puzzles. Uh. I guess we'll have to go to service. Uh, we're out there we can live by, right?
I'm legit running to the beginning. Look at this. I don't even know if I should be doing this. Oh, hey. <sighs> After all this time, you're still thinking about my hat. Please? Sure. I like your hat. Did you get it? It's a plate of lukewarm spaghetti. Seems like something's tried eating it and just gave up. Good job, mouse. You're getting all the snacks. The broadcast wants you to know this game is intended for... Oh, no, my channel is intended for... Uh... Snow to take a huge one. Uh, intended for mature audiences. Whoa! Forgot about that. I'm worried about getting older. I'll stop being a teen. No, I refuse. I'll just invent new numbers like 20 teen. <laughs> Holy crap. I do not remember there's, there being this much to the beginning here. Although I guess it has been a while. Hey, snowman! Ah, I can feel that piece of me has been well taken care of. Hmm, the berries open up. Hmm, and if it's not too much to ask, could you take that piece of meat to the surface? I'd really appreciate it. Hey! Well, he's happy that I've taken his piece with me this whole time. God, these bird things are- hey, more. The doctor, she brought my wife back from the dead. My son, he seems happy again. Our family is bigger than ever, now that my wife is combined with 16 other people. No. That's the snow one. Mom well, might have to share her mind with other people now, but she's still my mom. And that's cool. Cause uh we're made of ice and stuff. What? It's a joke, laugh at it! <laughs> fishing Never forget this out. It's fishing pole fixed to the ground, reel it in. Yes. It's a note. Never mind, guys. Well, nothing really happened with that note. There's a lamp. Oh, wait, I can hide. That was the lamp I could hide behind. I can't do it anymore. That was Sans shop. Is the music getting louder? Or is it just me? This is an awful long walk. I think I go to the surface by, um, talking to my friend. Whoa. Whoa. Oh, wait, is this taking me to, um, Toriel's house? I think this was Toriel's house. Yeah, okay, so this is Toriel's house. Is she in here? Those flowers are dead. Pie! Yes! Most of the pie is gone. There are dog prints in it. Gross. Okay, so I don't think Toriel's here. I'm gonna go check real quick. Whoa, that's real bright. Wait a minute, wasn't this the one that was locked? Just a regular old bucket of snails. It's Royal's diary read the circled passage. Yes. You read the passage. Why did the skeleton want a friend? Because she was feeling bonely. <laughs> the rest of the pages filled with jokes of similar caliber. Ah, that was the that's the one that's under renovation. Never mind. Jada, what are you doing? Stop, stop chomping your toes. Now you get owies. Tree. Every time this old tree grows any leaves, they fall right off. Oh, 
Holy crap. There better be a teleport to the end. This is insane. I did not think it was going to be this long of a run. Frogs! Yellow names were nice for a while. Next time we should try a relaxing shade of green. Ribbit, ribbit. Did you ever find this room's fourth frog? There's a fourth frog in this room? Ribbit, ribbit. Say, now that your journey's over, maybe you'll have time to listen to me. Since most people just press X to skip through my dialogue. That's right, pressing X. I suppose some things never change. <laughs> Cheese. Looks like cheese has been nibbled, taken, or been taken bites out of you. Yeah, yeah. This is the rock that couldn't move. The exit's open. Guess I better roll out. Hey, you mind giving me a push pumpkin? I'm trying to. Nope. He just keeps talking to me if I try to push him. Bye. Oh, God, no. Wait, wait, this is a this is a quick way out. Never mind. Easy way out. Oof. Right, but I still have to run all the way back to Snowden, which is nasty. Ah, oh, probably because people love you, Crimson. Ribbit, ribbit. Excuse me, human. You seem like you have grown since thoughtful and conscientious person. Whether that was for my advice or not, I'm quite proud. Ribbit. This freaking run is like 20 minutes. Okay, spikes. Can't talk to that one. Save point. The shadow of the ruins looms above, filling you with determination. Wait a minute, is it just a loop? Oh, hey. Cookie time! Want some cookies? Do you want some cookies? Here you go. Yum. Did you go for cookies? Mama, I want cookies. Did you go for some cookies? Did you go for some cookies? Hey, it's our friend. Uh. Your voice was something like this, I think? Because you 
Game awareness is aware of itself again. Chris, don't, don't kill and don't be killed, alright? That's the best you can strive for. Well, see you. Chris, don't you have anything better to do? Aw, alright. <laughs> Can't you use something and just teleport me back? Oh. All right, buckle up, kids. We got 20 minutes of running ahead. That's brutal. So much stinking running. I don't understand the, uh... They, so they combined their souls together. I got that. I don't know why. One of them was dying, I think. And then... Uh, I don't know why they turned into a flower. But Asriel said it was his fault. Or their fault. And I, I don't know. The whole situation is a mind trip for me. But we legit have like 20 minutes of running ahead, so, uh... Can this be a teleport? It says take one a piece of candy. Sure, I'll take a piece of candy. You took a piece of candy, press C to open the menu. Never mind. So, uh, I'm just gonna be staring at chat. <laughs> ah! For a hot minute. 
because that's all that's going to be happening is just a bunch of running. Tidbit wanted to free the monsters, right? But it turns out I'm not Tidbit. I'm Frisk. No! Oh, I didn't mean to sidestep. Nah. No! Oh, I have to go all the way. That's right. That got me the first time I did it, too. There. Get out of there. She... Tidbit wanted to freeze the monster, so she poisoned herself? And had Azriel absorb her soul. Really? Yeah, here, have some spiders. Give me a jug. Here you go. Give me a donut. So Azriel was a monster that absorbed a human soul. So the Azrael could go through the barrier and take six more human souls. But why did why did they want to go through the barrier at the first in the first place? Could to destroy the humans? Or oh, to free the monsters? Okay. But that makes it sound like Tidbit was a good person. To sacrifice himself to uh free the monsters. You know? Frog, frog. Ribbit, ribbit. Seems like the ruins have finally opened up. Maybe we should finally go out to the rest of the underground. Huh? The berry's open too? Let's just take this one step at a time, okay? Oh. Dang it. And so they did take Tidbit's body back to her village. They did? Oh, that's right. I think uh, Asgore said that. And then uh, the humans attacked him because they thought uh, he killed Tidbit, right? It's weird that I named myself Tidbit. And I went along with calling myself Tidbit. Even though... Does my per person have amnesia, maybe? Because otherwise, I'd be like, no, I'm not Tidbit. You know? And yeah, and then the humans attacked. Right. Okay, so I remember that part. And this run was stupidly long. Hey, guys, want to see a fat Michelangelo that makes me laugh? Look at this. Fat Mikey. It says, pizza has destroyed my life. And he has sad bits. You can't see it very well because it's on a small screen, but he's fat and it makes me laugh. Run and run and run. As we'll stop Tidbit from killing the humans. As real stopped him? Why would a human want to kill all the humans, though? Did they explain that? Did I just miss it? God, I wish there was a freaking... Ugh. Hey, Snowman. Could you take that piece of me to the surface? Okay. So much walking. 